Hey guys, welcome back. Modi101 here, and we are back in full craft, picking up right where we left off. There is a small chance that I may have forgotten to do off camera work. But luckily for us, it's a build series, so that's okay. I don't remember what I said I would do off camera, but whatever it is, it didn't get done. Also, I'd like to point out, for anybody who doesn't know, this is Heather's favorite series. What that means is she's watching right now. So everybody should go into the comment section and say, Hi, Heather. And Heather, don't disappoint. You're going to want to make sure that you say hi to everybody back. <laughs> oh, and she's sitting there giggling like angrily right now. And now she's giggling because I know she's giggling angrily. We have we have fun. I have fun. I don't know about anybody else. I'm having fun. Okay, so I think we're doing okay. Um, I do want to get into making like some of the rails and stuff like that, the railings and whatnot. But let's go ahead and finish lining up our shops and see if we can get this stuff at least beginning situated today. Oh, I just took out all those saplings. Okay. All right, got to get a little bit more oak. All right, come on, hold on. And we got to put all our stupid saplings back. All right, let's go. And two more. Perfect, perfect. Cool, okay. A little bit more oak, and let's start framing out these uh, little houses, apartment things for them. I'm going to try and figure out some cool things to do to, to spruce this area up. No pun intended. All right, so where did that go? Okay, here it is. Um, I don't need raw oak, so we're good there. All right, so we're finishing up the floor. So now, now like I had mentioned, what I want to try and do, and I'm hopefully thinking it will look good, is pretty much across this beam here, this line here, is where I want to make the fronts of the shops. So let's actually take this up a level. Actually, we should do it, be doing it from over here. All right, so we're going to go up a level here. And then we're going to start framing this. And I think we frame this in, what, spruce or something like that, right? All right, finish doing this. And we got to use our pick to get all the scraggler lines. We can actually use this to get these. I'm so much weirdly enjoying that little piece right there. I like that. All right. So clean this up. And then we're going to start lining things. Just finished off a hammer. All right. And it's going to go to here. We'll have to move this back a bit. So if we're going to here, we need to go up like that like that. Alright, cool. Uh, a little bit more scragglers over here. Okay, so um, these aren't going to be very big. Um, am I lining in spruce or is it dark oak? I'm pretty sure it's spruce, right? Yeah, spruce. Okay, so we're going to grab the limited amount of spruce we have. And then we're going to basically, where's my line here? Here, I think I might sneeze. <coughs> Jeez, <coughs> run for your lives. Okay, so let's uh, get up here. Um, let's do this and this. Up. Being weird about things. That is kind of cool. Maybe we'll have to, like, make something up there. All right. So we're going to come across, and I just want to line this out. All right. Let's see how it looks. So we're coming. So how, what, what are we doing here? It's just, ooh, am I too far forward? I may have to put, you know what? Let's see how this looks. There, and then the same thing here. Because we're probably going to kind of put a little bit of a lip on these buildings. But I want to make sure we have at least a two-block walkway. So if we have two blocks, so we're going to go here. Where is the meeting point? Is here. 
Alright, so let's do that. Alright, two. Oh, crap. Alright, we're gonna do the same thing again. Alright. And then we're gonna do the same thing here. And come across like. Ah! Oh, had to have one. Had to have the rebel in the group. Couldn't go along with the rest of the kids, could you? Rebels. All right, let's go grab some more spruce wood. Um, so that we can uh, get this kind of framed out. I like that so far. Like I said, I do. I'm purposely going straight across on that. Let's go sleep. Um, because it gives a little bit more. I don't know. Come on. Where's the sun? Go set. It's over there. I can't see it. Maybe it's not nighttime. Is this an eclipse? It's kind of been a big deal recently. Get in bed. Thank you. Sometimes it's nice to just sleep with the uh, the door open. Get that 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 fresh bog smell coming in from you know the swamps around here. All right, let's uh, go get ourselves some more spruce. Yeah, I think I forgot to do off camera work on this. I apologize, guys. It's probably uh, pretty important stuff I was supposed to do. Alright. Oh, you son of a jerk. <sighs> Sometimes big trees are awful. That's a shovel. And... Oh, God! Ow. Alright. Let's get up these saplings, get them replanted, because you know we're going to need more. Now, did everybody go say hi to Heather? Well, just in case any of you guys forgot. Because she's probably watching this when she's going to sleep. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going to go kill animals and get a bunch of food. Whoops. All right. So let's finish out. So we're probably going to have more apartments than stores. Because we technically have, what, four or five? But I want more, not apartments, but little living quarters. I want more cabins. There we go. I want more of those than five. Now, something that the reason I know Heather watches this series is because she keeps yelling at me. And why does she keep yelling at me? Because I keep putting wood in the back and then covering up and you can't see it and she feels like it's a waste. Whatevs. All right, so what I want to do, and we're going to kind of have to frame this out a little bit. So I'm thinking like... there so this is you know we can go back we're going to go back a little bit more then this is going to be a bigger one that comes back like this so this is going to come back like that okay so like i said not very big places we are going to put this wall back a little bit and why does this seem really dark back here uh f7 yeah i knew it i knew it i'm on to you and here and then this will be boom boom okay um, and are we just going to make them that small? I want, I want a variety of sizes. So let's go with this one a little off. All right, all right, all right. Now, something I just realized that will end up bothering me is I want the post to come up. So we got to do like this. I want that to happen. Where'd that would go? Okay. Um... Here, oh, I see you back there, little dark areas. There you go. All right, so this, give me that, and give me that. I want that up down post. Okay, so now we'll go one, two. Maybe this will be a, a slightly bigger one. All right, and that and that. Two, three, and there. Okay. So that's a slightly big one. Then I think we'll go like a, a smaller one here. So here and here, and then the posts come up. Perfect. All right. So I got really excited that I didn't have to jump up to do this one. Okay. And there. All right. That's that piece. Okay. And then we're going to go two. We'll make this one, I guess, a medium one. All right. Um, so we're going to go here and yay. Once again, got excited about something dumb. 
All right. There we go. And then finally, let's figure out here. So if we go like that, I guess these are going to be two small ones. Boo, boo, boo. All right. And bump, and bump, and bump. Okay. And then inside, we'll kind of lay these out like so. Making sure that we torch as we go. Okay. All right. Your road piece. And then this is going to go back here. Let's go like that and like that. And then this is going to go like this. And I want to make like a little sneaky, sneaky exit out of this, this house. We'll figure out it's like maybe our smuggler or something like that. Uh, these generally won't, these basically aren't going to be big enough to have windows, unfortunately. Um, but like I said, we're going to get, we're going to get a lot into the decoration. Um, we're going to do quite a bit with the deco craft I'm excited about. Because remember the, our, our kind of theme for this is like, you know, a, a bunch of sailors on like an, you know, old wooden ship get stranded here after a big storm and they use the parts of the ship to make their home here. So let's kind of take a little look-see, a little gander. I like that. I like that. And like I said, once we get into working with some posts, uh, we are going to have railings. Maybe we'll start that. Let's. How much time do we have? We got. We got plenty of time. Let's go start playing around with that a little bit. So we're going to need now. We got to figure out what these buildings are, and I think we're going to use our people. So we can do this. First. Ooh, a bit of lag spike. All right. So let's see who we have. So we got ourselves a toolsmith, a shepherd. Not going to need that. A guard, a cleric, a leather worker, another guard. Uh, Fletcher. I'm assuming that's like arrows and stuff, right? A librarian. I think that's about it. Because remember, we're going to go get more people. So I'm thinking we're going to take the toolsmith. So follow me. Um, I'm trying to remember. Should the toolsmith be... With it in the black, well, is there blacksmiths? We're gonna have to go find another village and see what other characters we have. So for for right now, follow me over here, and we're gonna make the toolsmith maybe like like this one over here. Okay. So for now, we're gonna go ahead and set home, and then we're gonna tell them to stay here. And this is kind of our way that we're gonna know who goes where. All right. And then we're gonna go grab uh, that, what was he, a leather worker? Which, you know, maybe we'll use that as like our armor and stuff. It's this guy here, no, shepherd, leather worker. So, uh, follow me. All right, come on. And then I think our leather worker probably not going to need a ton of space so I'm thinking we'll put him maybe in this one I think this is probably good for him all right wait leather worker right, stay here set home it's all bloody okay so there's that this is going to be food so we're going to probably need like a butcher in here I can't believe I didn't do the floors in here yet I need to do that Okay, so um, let's see. What do we what do we have village wise? Do we just have that one village? Let's wait for everything to load in before we can move. I think we kind of got everybody from here that we wanted. I believe. What is this building? Oh, this is a crazy furnace one. Ooh. What is that? Weapon case bow. Okay. Oh, I haven't tried. So I'm going to remember to come back here. 
Mm -mm. All right, so what do we got? Who did we leave behind? Who was not part of the Modi rapture here? Stop it. Stop it. Buttholes. Um, guard. Guard. Uh, guard. I don't remember us finding another village. Guard. Who's this guy? Librarian. We already have a librarian. Um, yeah. So, I think we pretty much got everybody from here that we wanted or that we could use. Um, hey, could you guys stop dying? Alright, so yeah, we're good here. Uh, so we're going to have to find another village, basically, to try and get a little bit more of a variety of people. I don't need a bunch of clerics. And honestly, I'm going to trade out. If I find, like, the priest and nun clerics, I'm, do I'm totally going to get those. So, All right, let's go home and clean up our inventory real quick. Uh, wait for everything to generate in. That is the wrong direction. All right, let's go this way. I might take out that second door. I don't think we need it. All right, so we clean up our inventory. And then we're going to get to doing some more of the stuff with the railings. I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Uh, let's put all this stuff away. Um, having trouble remembering where things go in this pack. This is wood. So put this stuff away. Let's open up this bad boy real quick. And we got ourselves a longbow. Third bow edition. Quality broken. Rarity common. Piece of junk. Okay, good to know. There's all our damn shrubs from the incident, as I like to call it. I'm not worried about this stuff. Give me that door. All right. Um, it is nighttime. Let us sleep. And then we're going to attempt to make the um, that little saw, saw blade table thing. So hopefully we can start doing some uh, fancying up around this place. All right. Come on. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. And like I said, the concept of this is kind of small and compact. We don't need huge areas or anything like that. Okay, so let's look at the saw. It's this guy right here. And so sticks, pressure plate, iron, no problem. Circular saw, stick and iron, large pulley, wood and sticks. So I'm seeing a theme of iron. Uh, let's get some of this. That's wood. There's sticks. Uh, I think we're good. All right. So let's make a pressure plate. Let's make not that. Let's make not that. This. All right. So one of these guys. Okay. And then a large pulley. Okay. And finally, an architect saw bitch. Now we're gonna take and we're gonna grab some of our spruce wood. And we're gonna take this over here. This is where it's gonna end up, but this is where we're gonna put it for now. All right, so some of the things we can do this. First of all, all right, I have spruce wood. So first of all, let's look and see what we got. Let's go to railings. These are these are pirates. Plain plain wait, what's that? No, I just want plain. Plain and basic. We're not gonna get too fancy. So now if we take these and we go like this. Right. And that's a headache. Give me that. Alright, so we go like this, and we're going to need a angled one there, and an angled one here, and an angled one there. So let's go make those real quick. Alright. Uh, 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 and I actually just thought of something we might do. We'll see how it looks. Alright, and then now we're going to want a couple of these. I think I only needed like three of them so it's not wasted all right so those corners match fine and then we'll go here here and there okay 
So now we got ourselves a, a railing, and it, it takes up a small part of the block, but we can still walk in it, which is why we really only need it to be too wide. And let's come back and take a little bit of a look. See, I like that. I like that a lot. And I know some people, that door is bugging you, but it's going to happen. See, it's already starting to add some personal size. So let's see what else we can, what other mischief we can get in here. So let's go ahead and I want to make um, some of these. I don't need a ton. Maybe, yeah, we'll start with 10. And then this is bottom transition. So we're going to, I don't need 10 of those. And then top transition. Okay. So we go like this. All right. And then I think here we need the top transition. If I can get to the right spot. All right. And then I use some of these guys we have left over to do that. And that just kind of ends there, right? And then where's our bottom transitions? Let's get down here at the bottom. Nope. I don't think I ever made that. I'm going to have to make the hammer, which means I'm going to need orange dye. So let's see. Okay, there's that. And that. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, let's see how it goes here. No, that's not going to work. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I think, uh, I think we're going to not do the bottom transition here. We need the plain ones. Why are you being a butt? That's because I put it on the wrong block. That's why I made there being a butt. And then here. Oh, my God. Here. Get out of here. Get. Beat it. Okay. And then we need the top transitions here. Like so. And like so. All right. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. It doesn't go all the way down, but that's fine. Because it goes all the way down down here. Oh, that looks so nice. I am such a fan of that, and I'm so excited that I'm starving. All right, well, it looks like we're at the end of this episode. So we got these framed out, and I think next episode we're going to keep working on kind of sprucing this up, which may mean there might be a little bit more change to that. But that alone, that right there seems cool. And then, like I said, my plan is is to kind of have a little bit of an awning coming off of this. I think it's going to look super duper awesome. So we're going to mess with that. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Questions, comments, concerns, put it down in the comment section. If you want to get some cool Modi Squad gear, go check out my spread shirt shop down below. All kinds of neato mosquito stuff there. And then uh, if you want to come hang out myself, Heather, where you can say hi to Heather, like in the comments, but live. And she'll probably yell at you, but it's it's a it's a loving yell, and that's what's important, um, you know. And also hang out with everybody else in the squad. Go check out the Patreon link; has all the information there. And uh, if you guys want to get your very own Minecraft server, uh, play with your friends, or have a a world you can have chunk load and all kinds of fun stuff. Go check out Aim to Game using our link down below. So you know you're coming from the squad. Use a coupon code to save yourself some money. Swing some bread around. Have some fun. And until the next episode, I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.